Thank you for taking a closer look at the Friedrich Dehumidifier. Convenient and easy to use, Friedrich's dehumidifiers feature precise humidity control and continuous drainage operation. Our models can treat areas up to 2,500 square feet, extract 25, 50, or 70 pints of moisture every 24 hours, and can be set to humidity levels ranging from 30 to 90 percent. The sleek, modern design will not detract from your decor. With a built-in drain pump, you no longer have to continuously check the bucket to see if it's full. The pump will remove water up to 15 feet in any direction, allowing it to drain to a sink or out a window. These efficient Energy Star qualified models also provide a removable condensate bucket with a carry handle that holds up to 16 pints of water. With a washable slide-out filter, low ambient operation, automatic defrost cycle, and a 24-hour timer, these powerful dehumidifiers are ideal for living areas, storage areas, basements, and equipment rooms, anywhere moisture is a concern, because they provide reliable, convenient operation. Another great feature is the easy roll casters that allow you to move the unit from room to room with ease. When not in use, the unit can easily be stored in most closets. Investing in a Friedrich dehumidifier can help you protect your home and your health. A broad service network, a team of technical experts, and U.S.-based customer support ensure you get the prompt service you deserve. If you demand the best, it has to be a Friedrich. The experts in room air conditioning. Frigidaire 70 Pint Dehumidifier we were very keen to put our hands on this Frigidaire basement dehumidifier, since it's a successor to a highly popular FAD 704 DWD Frigidaire from 2014. We couldn't wait to see which features the Frigidaire will put into their next dehumidifiers. Are these Frigidaire dehumidifiers a worthy heir to one of the best dehumidifiers of the decade? Read on and find out. The Frigidaire FFAD 7033R170 pint dehumidifier works like this, it pulls the excess humidity from the basement's air in the form of moisture, collecting it in its 13.1 tank that has a splash guard, a handle, and the auto shut-off function. If you put it next to a drain and run it in a continuous way, the Frigidaire FFAD 7033R1 will be able to collect some 70 pints of water per day, which is really impressive. We liked how easy the Frigidaire is to operate this thing. The so-called Ready Select control panel include a control lock, the digital humidity level readout, as well as the very helpful 24 hours on-off timer that allows the user to set the time for a shutdown. The Frigidaire screens are very easy to read, letting you control the humidity's percentage in whichever room you put this Frigidaire dehumidifier in. The combination of a top handle, side handles, and the caster wheels also makes the machine very easy to move around, this is always a big plus in our book.
Home Labs 4500 SQ Ford Energy Star Dehumidifier with supersized coverage for spaces up to 4,500 square feet, this large dehumidifier from Home Labs is well equipped to monitor and manage humidity levels in areas with temperature fluctuations aka basements. Thanks to a turbofan setting, you can increase circulation up to 188 CFM cubic feet per minute, which gives the unit a leg up in particularly damp areas. This Home Labs unit is rated to remove 50 pints of moisture per day from the air, and reviewers note how they like its multiple modes of operation. The continuous mode is a good bet for really damp areas where around-the-clock moisture management is necessary, while the comfort mode allows the unit to adjust target humidity based on the ambient temperature of the space. There's also a manual mode which lets you select the target humidity level and causes the unit to cycle on and off until meeting such conditions. For a basement dehumidifier, you likely want to elect for continuous drainage operation. With a suitable drain nearby and the addition of a threaded hose itself preventing you from needing to empty the somewhat limited 1.8-gallon water tank. 